We are exploring. Today in Totsuck, Arkansas in Perry County, after the flood of 2019, which crested in early June that year. And we are here in August, a couple of months later. The one-stop gas station and Arkansas State Highway 60 were three to four feet underwater. And so was this house. Look at the sand that has been deposited on the patio of this building. And this damage here is not cosmetic. You can see how the wall caves in. The waters have washed out the sand from underneath the concrete foundations and made these houses fall into deep holes just like this mobile home. The soil has been washed away around the roots of these trees. I have not seen anything like this before. These buildings are destroyed. These families have lost their homes and probably most of their belongings. How sad. Deposited sand formed these sand dunes here, which is bizarre and here you can see the foundation the concrete foundation has cracked and the mobile home has fallen into this hole that the waters created this home is destroyed this is so sad to see there's an uprooted tree and another foundation you can see how the water washed out the sand and caused the, con the foundation to shift and crack. Look at that roof over there and the cinder blocks. This home is destroyed. Wow. Here's another view. Here in Totsak, maybe a dozen residences were affected this severely with their homes being destroyed and people for a few weeks found shelter, temporary shelter in nearby Conway, Arkansas. But still, seeing this, their lives have been changed dramatically. Just imagine losing your home. Look, here's a car. There's a fence and lots of debris that has accumulated around it and the rear window has been pushed in by debris in the water or by the forces of the water itself. There is, there are leaves and there is debris here that had been held back by the fence and there is another, another destroyed structure over here. These cinder blocks have been pushed out of their position by the water and this trailer here with th three four feet was certainly submerged because this is a little lower down than the road and the road was covered with three to four feet of water. Totsuck Park is still closed two months after the flood. I hope you found this video interesting. I found it sad to take and see people lose their homes.